Do you want more likes, comments and sales on Instagram? Do you need people to follow you or do you send them to your website? Using powerful call to action on Instagram is the key to get your followers to do what you want. And here are the best ones that you cannot miss. You're sitting in your living room checking your phone. You can hear the rain against the window and the wind blowing outside. It's a grain and rainy day. You grab your phone from the table. You want to check your last post. Did you get any likes, comments and followers? You open the app. You go to notification. You swipe down. You really had a good feeling about this post. You were excited, but now you feel defeated. What is the point of posting when nobody engages with it anyway? You feel like you've wasted your time with creating this post. And you might even worry that others see that your post flopped and think that you're no good. The biggest mistake that I see many coaches make when they're creating content is they don't include a call to action. And what is a call to action? Think about it like double tap if you agree or check out my website for more information. It's a clear description of what you want people to do after they saw your content. This is what our marketing is all about. We want people to do what we want. Many coaches underestimate how powerful call to actions are to their clients. In reality, if you don't give your followers a compelling next step, they will simply keep scrolling and your post and all the engagement will die unnoticed and defeat. But you probably also are not aware about all the different places you need to use call to actions to get the most out of your marketing effort. And we'll cover this towards the end of the video, so make sure that you keep watching until the end. However, with a clear call to action, you convert the intention that you have into measurable results. You drive up engagement like likes, comments, and you get more sales. Your post will be shown to more people so you can draw more people in. And the people that already follow you? Using call to actions in your stories gets you more traffic to your, to your website. Or your followers send you a DM to learn more about your coaching. Adding a strong call to action in your Instagram captions comes with barely any extra effort but with a lot more engagement. So let's talk about the different types of call to actions and some simple formulas that you can use today. For boosting likes on Instagram, use calls to actions like like this post if, for example, like this post if you agree with my perspective. You can also say double tap if you agree. I use this type of call to actions for funny or relatable posts or reels, ideally with an image of you inside. Relatable memes are another great content source to get more likes. You can also use it with simple infographics that you share on your feed. By the way, I have a video at the end where I go through the different types of content that get engagement with proof from my own account. So keep watching if you need proven content ideas that improve your engagement. To get more comments, use calls to actions like let me know what you think or do you agree? Comment below. Or when you offer a couple of different strategies for meal prep, you can ask something like, which is your favorite? People love to give their opinion. So make it easy for them by giving them two options to choose from and ask them to vote with a simple emoji or a letter. Low friction common options are often much better than using a paragraph. Remember those relatable stories that we talked about? Think about a story where your, where your audience says, oh my God, this is just me. Then share it and ask, can you relate? Share below. How about saves? I like to use a simple formula like save this one for, for example, save this discovery called script because it will literally make you money. Great content for saves are step-by-step -step tutorials or how-to guides like a kitchen makeover. You can also share resource lists like great habit trackers to use. You can share a collection of different meal prep approaches so they can adjust based on their current needs. With content that gets saves, always think about how you can create a shortcut so your followers will literally save time and money by saving your post. To make more sales, use calls to actions on Instagram like click the link in my bio too. This is a great way to increase traffic to your website or DM me for more information about. You can also say something like book your spot by to get free personalized tips to lose your first five pounds. Never forget that you have to sell your free strategy calls beyond it's free. And if you want to know how to do it, comment call below and I will share a video with you where I explain five different irresistible ways to invite people to a discovery call. Other content that naturally goes with this call to action is testimonials. And please remember, testimonials don't have to be huge. You can ask for smaller testimonials after an intake session or 
after they have experienced their first small win. And you can also use your own transformation as proof. Other ways are to share behind the scenes work with your clients or when you work on a new program. And of course, sneak peeks into your program, for example, what you cover in the first two weeks. Another great idea here is to invite people to your coaching. And I've actually created a video where I share my top three invitation posts word for word. So keep watching. I link the video at the end if you want to learn how to invite people to your coaching program without being salesy. But we are not done yet. These have only been Instagram calls to actions for captions. Let's talk about Instagram call to actions for stories. We know that sharing your post to your story increases reach and views, but most coaches either hide their post or share it without context. It's a missed opportunity to give your viewers a clear direction what you want them to do. For example, add a line or two of context enticing them to click on the image, or add a sticker with tap here or a poll asking them if they struggle with the topic you are sharing. If you do a mini training, a testimonial or a cool resource, invite people to learn more by sending you a DM. You can write something like, send me the word summer if you're ready to get in the best summer shape. Also, with a new ability for Instagram users to add a link to their story, be mindful of the option to customize it. So use links like click here to get all the details to drive people from Instagram to your website. The question stickers are powerful tools to learn more about the challenges that your followers have. Use open-ended questions like, what is your biggest challenge with right now? You can learn a lot about the pains from your followers and the content you should be covering. Also, remember the poll content where you ask people to comment an emoji or a single letter? You can perfectly adapt this content for stories with a multiple choice story sticker. If you want to more engagement on your reels, the same rules apply like your feed posts. For funny and relatable reels, often trends, use a like. For resource lists, use saves. Google grab and go tips they can immediately take away, ask them to follow for more content. And when you share controversial or unpopular opinions, ask for comments. There are two more places where you need to consider call to actions that many coaches miss. Call to actions in your Instagram bio and in your highlights. The most common mistake that I see many coaches make in their Instagram bio is they either have no call to action or multiple ones. So take a second and think about what is your current biggest business priority. Do you want more followers, more people to book a call, sign up for a free lead magnet or a webinar? This is the one call to action you want in your bio right now. Because when people visit your page, they are looking for information. They are curious. So give them a clear direction of what to do. For example, follow for specific inspiring result. Or book a free call to get free personalized tips to lose five pounds in the next two weeks. Or download my recipe book for women over 50 struggling with menopause weight gain. This is how you gain more followers, get more traffic to your website, or sign up more people to your discovery calls. The other area where coaches miss out on are the Instagram bio highlights. Think about highlights like the front window in a local store. If somebody watches it, you want them to come inside, especially if you have a free discovery call to offer or you want people to reach out to learn about your coaching. Use a series of stories with, compel with a compelling call to action and save the story stack in your highlights. Your call to action can be to visit your website, to book a call or to DM you. In my next video, I will cover how to structure and optimize your strategies for Instagram highlights. You will learn some cool hacks and story formulas that will help you get more views and engagement on your story. So make sure that you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the next video. And if you learn something about call to actions on Instagram, please like this video. Now check out these videos on writing great invitation posts for your coaching and caption formulas that get likes, comments and sales.